Big news tonight in the sports world. ASU hiring Todd Graham as the new football coach. ABC 15's Jeff Eisner joining us now live from ASU where they're making that big announcement. And Jeff, not really a familiar name, so who is this guy and what exactly do we know about him? Well, you're exactly right. He's not one of the big names that the Arizona State alums really wanted to go after and really wanted to get after a disappointing year for the Arizona State football game. But Todd Graham is the man now. He went 6-6 six and six at Pitt last year, spent only one season in the Big East there at Pitt. Before that, he was at Tulsa for four years. Pretty impressive run at Tulsa where he was the head coach there. Three bowl wins, three Conference USA titles there. So he does have a pretty good record of 49-29. and 29. But Graham did use... Pitt is a stepping stone, also used Rice as a stepping stone, staying there only one year. Now we talked with Al Jerkins from our sister station in Tulsa, who covered Graham for a number of years. He had some very interesting thoughts on this hire for Arizona State. Mile a minute guy, I'm telling you, he's 24-7. I mean, that, if, you're, if you're looking for an energetic kind of guy, he's it. Todd Graham is more of a defensive guy. He was the defensive coordinator here before he went to Rice. So I would think that you know, his expertise is more defense than offense. So to say what kind of offense he's going to run, I th think has more to do with the personnel and the guy he hires as his offensive coordinator. Well, the news conference scheduled for 5.30. A lot of reaction coming in on Graham, and Tim Vetcher joins us now. And, Tim, it's not all positive, is it, right now? No, Jeff, you know, a lot of talk leading up to this was that ASU needed to make a big splash, mm -hmm. kind of move the meter, if you will. And talking with ASU fans today, the consensus seems to be that Todd Graham doesn't exactly accomplish that goal. At Karsten Golf Course for the 100 Club's annual tournament, the talk on the tee box seemed to focus on a different sport, football, and the news of a new head coach for the Sun Devils. The crazy thing is, I think if you pulled ASU alumni right now and you told them this was the hire, I think most people would have said, let's give Coach Erickson another year. Tim Hovick didn't mince words to describe his disappointment over the hire. Safe to say the name Todd Graham doesn't do much to impress this ASU fan. I'm pretty sure I've been following him about as close as anybody, and that's the first time I've ever heard his name brought up. So uh, I, uh, you know, they worried about one in the press conference. I don't even know if they're going to have one. Sports talk show host Dave Burns expressed a similar sentiment. He tells me the move leaves ASU looking desperate. My guess is they were having a really hard time finding somebody who wanted this job. And the clock was ticking. They had to bring somebody in. They're losing recruits. They're losing assistant coaches. But not all ASU fans took such a dim view. Some actually do like the decision. Jim D, for one, says he's at least willing to give Coach Graham a chance. I think it's uh, going to be a great move. I mean, I think the team needed a new coach. Uh, you know, things were getting kind of stale there. So I'm pretty excited about it. We've also been monitoring social media today. A lot of traffic on Todd Graham, especially on Twitter. Andrew Grumman writing, if ASU wants bigger hires, put more bodies in the seats. Jeff, it remains to be seen if Todd Graham can do that here at uh, Sun Devil Stadium. Yeah, that's right. 5.30, the press conference coming. And an interesting note about Graham, three of his assistants just left Pitt. They went to Arizona to coach with Rich Rod. So how about that, Steph? Hmm, very interesting. So we look forward <laughs> to finding out more uh, after that press conference. And we'll have that at 6. Jeff Heisner reporting. Absolutely. Yeah, thanks very much for that. One hope.